The ceremony got on the way immediately the president arrived at the venue, much to the excitement of party loyalists. After a few remarks by the chairman of INEC, the certificates of return were issued to the president-elect and his vice. To make a few remarks. So may I utmost respect? We must all see it as a victory for Nigeria, our dear country. That was why I encouraged my team and supporters in a speech I read earlier today not to gloat. Reacting to the APC's victory at the polls, some returning lawmakers highlighted what Nigerians should expect from the administration in the next four years. 2019 has clearly shown that Mr. President means well for this country, that the APC administration is focused, that we have laudable and noble projects and programs for this country, and we have done it. That is why Nigerians didn't find it difficult to vote for Mr. President and mass. All of us should join hands together to move Nigeria to the next level. And I mean by giving the president optimal support because he can't do it alone. With an overwhelming majority, will the legislature be a rubber stamp of the executive? There will be a national assembly that will support all the programs and projects of APC administration led by President Muhammad Buhari. And if supporting those programs and projects will be categorized as a as rubber stamp, so be it. No, no parliament can be a rubber stamp. Our constitutional role is well stated in the constitution. Okay? The only problem we have is that when people don't, when people are discussing from ignorance and then they don't know exactly what's going on. The president has assured Nigerians that Nigeria will be a country moving to the next level. From Abuja, Aon Duna, India, STV News.